On today's episode of Going to the Worst Rated Makeup Artist, I actually go back to, believe it or not, one of the makeup artist salons that I've been to previously in Paris um, about a year ago. And I was scared before going in if she was going to recognise me or if she saw the video, but she didn't, which was good for me. Um, So I thought, why not just go back in? The salon was near me where I live in Paris, so I thought, why not see if one year later she has got better and improved? So let's get into it. J'ai oublié là. Ah, oublié. <rire> oui, parce que vous avez beaucoup de clientes. Mm-hmm. Ça fait longtemps. Euh, ça fait à peu près un, un, un an que je suis. Mm, oui, oui, oui. On va goûter d'eau, madame. Oui, 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 allez. Un petit pour, un petit pour, euh, pour, les, pour, les, pour les bases, hein. Pardon? Un pour le, euh, oui, non, ah. c'est pour les pâtes. Ah, d'accord. Voilà, comme ça, un petit peu, voilà. I no idea what she was saying about no, it was you know? for whatever, but all my French girls, if you know what she was talking about, then let me know. Sinon, après, c'est ça. Ça va rester. Ah, pas rester. Euh, quelle couleur la 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 couleur la couleur parle Andy pour Andy pour so at this point um there was like some weird bo smell okay <laughs> and I was thinking to myself, okay, maybe is it me? Like, because I was wearing like a really big hoodie, as you can see. But then, like, every time, like, her hand just kept coming near my nose, it, it was obviously, I, I realised it was coming from her hands. So, yeah, I literally am getting BO mixed in with foundation, cemented all over my face right now. But hey, you know look on the bright side of things you know at least it's building up my immune system you know because I'm being exposed to bacteria you know at least my immune system is going to get stronger from this So this is literally the woman was too stunned to speak moment, me being the woman, Um, which is quite ironic because she is shaving my flipping moustache right now. My eyes were closed, like people in the comments section always say, oh you look like you like were startled, it's because my eyes are closed like more than 80% 80% of the time during the appointment so I am trusting my face with these makeup artists so they can they literally can do whatever they want to me because my eyes are closed do you know what I mean so 
I was just so stunned that she even did that. Without my permission, might I add. Like, she must have just, like, looked at my moustache. Which I don't even... I have, like, a bit of peach fuzz, okay? Leave me alone. I have a bit of peach fuzz, but... I guess it was too much for her that she had to grab the shaver thing. So yeah. Or well, at least, at least it could have been worse. She could have done that to my eyebrows. So yeah. Let's look on the positives here. So uh, it's been one year since I've been to this makeup artist and she still hasn't got brushes. I guess that it's a purposeful choice to not get makeup brushes. I mean, hey, most of you in the comment section last time told me that at least it's, you know, hygienic than getting a disgusting, dirty brush, which I agree with you. I agree with you completely. <laughs> Regardez un peu la photo. Oui. Encore plus, tu vois, pas carré. Après, avec un liner. Ah, je vais prendre le pinceau, d'accord. Oui. Avec ça, c'est pas bon. Avec ça, c'est pas. C'est pas ouais. So I was just telling her that I wanted the eyes to look a bit more smoky, but she told me that she that you couldn't do smoky eye with the eyeshadow and that she was going to do it with the eyeliner. I don't know how that made sense, but how that even actually still makes sense, but yeah. So for all of you girls who tell me, you know, tell them what you want, you know, there's just no telling these makeup artists what you want because they, they, they are, I'm not joking, they are just going to do whatever they want to do. They have a vision in mind, I guess and they're just gonna go for it bless her heart she was very really, really sweet but you know what 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 can i do in that situation force her <sighs> Ah, 
Après, c'est pas tout de suite ça, je crois. I really am sick of seeing myself with black eyebrows. Like, it just looks weird. Like, they can just put brown. Just because I have dark brown, it looks black. Honestly, I'm not just saying that. It might, they may look black, but they are, they are actually dark brown, have dark brown hair. So, I just don't understand why they would think black eyebrows with blonde hair looks good. I really wish that they would stop doing that. Il faut être bien hein. là. Sinon, je avec fait avec l'âme. Hein? Oui, parce que j'essaye, tu vois, de les pousser en ce moment. Je vais pas, je vais pas les épiler pour le moment. Je vais faire après. Pas mal. Ça, c'est. You can see for a split second the sheer terror in my eyes. I literally thought that she was grabbing that shaver blade thing, but thank God it was just 
this comb I literally was gonna I don't even I wouldn't even know what how would he, I would even react to be honest I don't even want to put myself in a state of mind to even think about how I would react if that was the case but thank god it wasn't Ah oui, là ça vient. C'est bon Oui. Euh, le... Uva, uva, pero agua. ¿Se pica? No, se pica. Ne pas coller.
uva. Tá lá? Essa piga? Nossa, vá. Tá vá, Ui. Tá vá? So I usually don't buy this brand, so I wouldn't know, but the paddle, like the doe foot of this lipstick, like had no cushion on it. Like usually a lipstick like that usually has like a cushion on the doe foot, but there was like no cushion on that doe foot. <laughs> so I don't know if this brand usually doesn't have a cushioned doe foot but it was like the strangest sensation ever on my lips having just like plastic it was like a paddle like you know like to paddle on a boat like it was like it felt like that that was the texture of it like a paddle on my lips it was really weird I literally felt like I was at a dentist. You know when they like pull on your mouth really weirdly, like I literally felt like it was like that. But I guess she's like, I guess it's a good thing that like, you know, she's paying attention to detail. Like she's really getting inside the mouth there, getting all into the crevices and all to the cre inside the creases. But yeah, I mean, I felt like I was having a teeth examination to be honest. She might as well. I've just looked inside my mouth at this point, to be honest. But I do appreciate the attention to detail. Ça sent bien. Mm -hmm. mm. Mais moi, je choisis pas cette mais c'est très joli. Mm. Voilà, très joli. Mm. Ça semble tout ça. <rire> oui, ça change. Merci. Um, 
her hand smelled of B.O. so badly. Like every single time her hands were like near my nose, like it just smelled so badly of B.O. And like before me, she had like a client and she was waxing the client. So I think it obviously must have been like that. Sorry, I completely didn't explain that well. What I meant to say was before me, she had a client that she was waxing. So she must have obviously been waxing her armpit or something because they smell B.O. afterwards so um but um, yeah it just was grotesque like right now all I want to do is just take this makeup off because like I can I can still like smell the B.O. on my face um yeah other than the sheer shock that like she also like um was like she shaved my moustache, can't believe that. Um, other than the sheer shock of that, I don't think that, that the makeup is obviously that bad. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go home now and take this off immediately because as always, I've got a makeup wipe. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, so I'll speak to you guys in a bit.